10. Shane Dawson Shane Dawson recently got in a long-standing feud with YouTubers Taddy Westbrook and James Charles, which was the start of his downfall. Though, let's face it, he's been teetering on the edge of controversy for a very, very long time. The commotion between the YouTubers got fans looking more closely into Shane Dawson's history, and it was revealed that he had made some seriously sexual comments about Willow Smith back when she was just a minor. An 11-year-old minor, to be exact. The comments were a big enough scandal that Jada Pinkett Smith got involved with the incident herself. The actress was not happy over the comments directed at her daughter, and neither were Dawson's former fans. Cancelled. Even Jeffree Star is out of the friend circle, and that is one diva who is used to drama. 9. Leah Michelle. Leah Michelle was well known for her days as part of the Glee cast, but it was only this previous year that her castmates started coming out with horror stories about how Leah acted on set and off it. Her outbursts were so great and caused such a fuss that the fans left her cancelled, and her contract started to drop her as a result. The only person on her side still? Amber Riley, who asked that people go easy on Leah because she's pregnant. The fans said, not a chance, and held true to their disapproval and cancellation of the former acting star. It's going to be pretty tough for her to get another job. 8. Demi Lovato This one's a little on the funny side because Demi Lovato didn't actually do anything, at least nothing with concrete proof. Fans found a Twitter account under a different name they believe to be Demi, which she used to make fun of Selena Gomez? Seems like a lot of work for a little one-off comment, but fans cancelled her over it all the same, using the hashtag Demi is over party on Twitter. It's faded quickly enough though, just another blip in her day. In fact, most people even came around to congratulate her for her engagement just a month or so later. As a last piece of evidence here, Demi Lovato is with her boyfriend going live on the fake account. It's a little too close for comfort if not. 7. Lana Del Rey After fans agitated the singer with claims that her songs didn't empower women, Lana Del Rey tried to counter by pointing out that many female singers had songs that weren't focused on empowering women. Among these singers, she named Beyonce, Doja Cat, Cardi B, Ariana Grande, and a few others. This actually made things worse as fans latched onto the fact that many of these singers are POC and they cancelled her with a trending tag hashtag Lana Del Racist, despite her claims otherwise. 6. Vanessa Hudgens When Coachella was cancelled this year due to the COVID-19 pandemic, Vanessa Hudgens must have taken it as a personal slight. She took to Instagram to say, even if everybody gets it, like yeah, people are going to die, which is terrible, but inevitable? and the internet as a collective whole decided that was completely out of line and cancelled her for it. She's since come out and apologized for her remarks, but people aren't convinced and have staunchly kept up their tirade against her. Many people think that it was an apology just for the sake of her career. Either way, we are clear on the fact that COVID-19 isn't something to poke fun of, no matter who you are or what's been cancelled. This one was just stupid, but see it for yourself. 5. Onision. Greg Jackson, better known as Onision, wasn't just cancelled, he was also banned from Patreon. Why? For publicly doxing a woman online. For those not in the know, this means that he shared the address and the number of a woman online and asked followers to harass her. The woman is an alleged victim of Onision and his husband Kai, and claims that the duo harassed and groomed her for years. The cancellation also resulted in a ban against Onision in YouTube's partner program, which is no doubt going to put a hurt on his fame and his funds. There's been a total cancellation of the memes, TikToks, and other internet content that had previously spread about and made him famous. His Patreon account was disabled, and he blamed the fans and haters, but really, he should be blaming himself. He went absolutely insane in this clip, which is just one of his many twisted outbreaks. We're actually kinda glad he was cancelled. 4. Doja Cat The hashtag Doja Cat is over party made the rounds this past year when some videos surfaced. The contents? Doja Cat taking part in some racist chat rooms. This got a little bit awkward when it was revealed that she hadn't actually been involved in the conversations, and then pointed out to her fans that she is, in fact, a black woman. Hashtag we are sorry Doja made the rounds shortly after this comment was shared. How exactly did her fans manage to forget about that? 
We have no idea. 3. Jimmy Fallon Jimmy Fallon was recently victim to cancel culture when an old video from 2000 surfaced. It was an SNL skit in which Jimmy Fallon wore blackface on stage. This is possibly the worst thing that could have come up, especially given the current climate. This kicked off swift discussion and the drama was started up. There was discussion about how people can grow and whether something that took place 20 years in the past is really worth canceling someone over. People ended up landing on both sides of the fence and Jimmy Fallon apologized profusely for the skit. It seems, however, that it may be the end of Jimmy Fallon. 2. Ellen DeGeneres Ellen DeGeneres has been famous for a lot of things over the years, most recently being canceled over having a toxic work environment behind the scenes of The Ellen Show. It's not just the crew members who have come forward talking about the frankly harsh work environment, but one of Ellen's bodyguards came out and called her the coldest celebrity that he's ever worked with. She at first denied these claims, then apologized for them and promised to work at changing the way things were done in the future. The apology did not get her out of the hot seat. 1. J.K. Rowling Perhaps the biggest splash in 2020 was the transphobic tirade that J.K. Rowling went on over Twitter. It started as a comment, turned into an essay, and went so far as to her unfollowing Stephen King after the author stated that he supported trans women in a tweet of his own. Other actors from the Harry Potter franchise have come forward and stated that they do not agree with her views on the matter, and the fandom, known for its inclusive nature, has all but turned their backs on the author, attempting to claim the Wizarding World for themselves instead. These were once much-loved celebs. Are there any that you still love? We would love to know in the comments. Until next time, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a great day. We'll see you soon.